everyone welcome back to my channel Herrera here I hope that you are all doing well listen here you're telling me that I am going to prefer JR to Chris Lawrence and to Kel now I really don't want to believe you but you are also telling me that JR is the king of R&B I am so ready for this every day I get deeper and deeper this is JR on the wish bus performing his own song I believe this is not a cover called Bucket Paba um translating to why do I is that right it's English subbed I'm sure he's going to explain to me in a second. I don't know what to expect from him. Do you know what? Secretly, deep down inside, I'm hoping he'll have a deeper voice, somewhat like a honey texture. Um, and then I don't really know. I'll just leave it up to him to surprise me, to wow me, to win me over. <laughs> Deeper indeed. Wish 1075. Instantly soothing. This is different, a different feel, very honey like. Exactly what I was. Praying for, hoping for. <laughs> Ooh, that onset. Now this voice is 100% romance. Oh, what a day today is. What have I stumbled upon? A totally different feel. And he's singing with a little bit more authority. That voice is 100% honey. It is 100% romance. And he's got such control over it as well. Already in the couple of minutes that I've seen of this, I know the pace of the song is slow, but I've already heard lots of different aspects in his voice that are ticking my boxes. So there's the warmth the romance. He's got controls over his rips, riffs and transitions. He's got a beautiful vibrato as well and naturally his voice sits a little bit lower down. I mean I am really loving this and a song like this I can tell structurally I'm really going to love this. <laughs> Yaring pag ibig mo, oh, ini wan pag wagas. I'm sorry. Yaring pag ibig mo, oh, ini wan pag kita. The way he is really taking his time over everything, he thoroughly enjoys what he does. He enjoys having a voice like this. And it makes me, as a listener, enjoy listening to the song because he's just, he's embellishing everything, making it his own. This is his story to tell. <laughs> this is not okay, by the way. 
kinay nagmamakaawa Nooy di marinig pagsamo mo Please behave yourself. Uh, there's something about deeper voices, older sounding voices that grab me by the heart. I just have so much time in my life for these sorts of voices. Now, don't get me wrong, young voices are nice. They're uplifting, they're energetic, and they're pure. But a voice like this, you know he's lived a life. He has had real experiences. He has been in real love. Not just first love. He's had his heart broken. And all of that, with the genre of R&B, it just goes so incredibly perfectly. Like, I just, I can't fault this voice whatsoever. I just cannot believe that this is happening to me on a day-to-day -day basis, basically. <laughs> He gets a bit throaty as well. Whatever he is doing, he is painting that picture. This is utterly magical. That key change, that hint at a key change was just such a tease. And the way that he suddenly just went back into being all Mr. Honey again. <laughs> and also him like interacting with fans in the middle of all of this, readjusting his microphone. Pro. Nice, not too much tension here too. Oh my goodness. If somebody asked you for forgiveness like that, you would forgive them in an instant, wouldn't you? That I just cannot get over the amount of warmth that this voice has. I need more recommendations for JR, like immediately. Please drop me a comment below and talk to me about JR and about his career. Um, update me, get me up to speed, and then talk to me about this performance as well. This is a beautiful song, really nice to listen to, somewhat repetitive. However, I think with R&B, I can deal with that. I don't need it to be over the top, like lots of different structures going on in it. It needs to be like that. So then the voice can just carry along in its wave. Um, really beautiful. I mean, I think topic wise, a song about forgiveness could not have been matched with a voice like any more perfectly than this. He sounds sincere, and with that sincerity comes warmth, energy. He also sounded romantic, as in he's, he's feeling bad about the bad behaviour. 
is wanting to make it up to you. This was so beautiful. I mean, can I go back to that first, very first thing? Wish 1075. If I was not sold on those first two lines, then I wouldn't be myself. <laughs> this is why I listen to music. This is why I kind of believed you when you said I was going to prefer him. I was like, is it possible? I'm sure it is. Philippines is just full to the brim of so much talent, especially in this direction. I'm really looking forward to, I mean, I just want some collaborations now, to be honest. They don't even need to be singing their song. I've now found voices that, yes, I'm looking forward to getting to know their songs, but I just want them to sing everything and anything all the time, everywhere. I've just got really greedy, haven't I? Now I kind of want to hear all of these voices that I'm picking up everywhere sing a song together. It doesn't even have to be their own song, I just want to hear them sing. <laughs> It's that kind of feel-good music, feel-good voice that they're not here to necessarily prove a point. They're here to convey emotions and feelings and really make you feel through these songs. Absolutely stunning. What a stunning voice. Thank you so much for sharing this with me and for watching this with me. I hope that you had fun. And until I see you next time, take care. Stay safe. Bye.